Hey guys, what's going on? It's Wayne. Today we have another cool video, particularly related to keyboards, but more in the sense of the cables, the cables that connect to the keyboard themselves. And you're probably asking me, Wayne, 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 isn't it just a USB-C or a micro USB cable? Oh God, if you guys have a keyboard with a micro USB cable, throw that out, please. <laughs> but it is true, it's just a cable, USB-C cable going to your keyboard, and that will suffice. It will do what it needs to do. But, have you guys ever seen those coiled cables or those very skinny uh, like cables that just look really, really fancy with their like metal anodized like connectors and whatnot? Yeah, we got a bunch of those today to unbox and also I will be teaching you guys how to build your own and make your own custom keyboard cable for your build. So sit tight, relax, enjoy this video about cables out of all things and enjoy how beautiful, how beautiful these cables are from Cable Mod. Thank you Cable Mod for sending these out. I am so stoked to unbox these with you guys. Let's go. All right, so we've unboxed several Cable Mod cables that were sent to me, and honestly, they look absolutely amazing. Uh, out of five of them, three of them were actually customized by me on their website, and so I'll be going over how I customize my cables and just show you guys how easy it is to make your own custom cables with the Cable Mod interface. Let's go ahead and try this out. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is go to cablemod.com and click on their keyboard cables tab. And this will bring you to this amazing looking uh, interface where it just shows you how they make their keyboard cables and how they do their sleeving up to their pro coils and how they handcraft it. So it's kind of cool how they show all of this right in front of you. The other thing they have are these preset cables that they've already kind of like made. So it's kind of cool that they already have these offered to you guys if you don't wanna like do your own custom cables and you can just go ahead and buy it from their website and even some of them on Amazon, which is really, really cool. So another thing is they have three different tiers for their preset cables. Uh, one being the Pro Coil cable. I showed you guys, it was the uh, this cable right here, the purple one, uh, really, really cool. They call it Rum Raisin, uh, but it has the, you know, the aviator uh, connector, which is really dope. And you can connect that uh, to whatever you feel like doing later if you have more than one of these cables. Uh, the other one they have is the Pro Straight cable. So similar to my custom uh, white and blue straight cable with the Lima connector. Uh, this time it's just the aviator connector and you have uh, you know preset colors and themes as well and then you have the classic coiled cables just like how I have my lime sorbet which is like the green cable that I had uh, there's no connector on this one but it still is a coiled cable and nevertheless it still looks really really nice I commend cable mod for giving us all these different tiers especially if you're in different types of budgets especially when you're building in the mechanical keyboard world because you know you can be in the budget budgets or you can even go into the very extreme tiers of 
key cult keyboard world. So yeah, I definitely like how Cable Mod was able to give us all these different assortments of preset cables. But let's get into the meat of things in how you can customize and order your own custom cable uh, to whatever dream keyboard build you are doing. So we're back on to the main page and now we're gonna scroll down here to check out Configurator. Uh, this is where it's gonna take you to how to customize your own custom keyboard cable. So I'm personally gonna go with the complete cable. It has the connector and the coiled cable as well. And then you have these four options. So just like how the preset cables that we got earlier, you got the pro coiled, the pro straight, there's a classic straight and even a classic coiled. Uh, you just wanna choose whatever fits your you know budget. There's different prices, again, $50 USD, 58, 90 USD. $30 just for the pro straight, which is kind of cool. And $25 for the classic straight. I'm going to go with the pro cold because that's what I personally like when I am making my custom cables. I'm going to hit this red button down in the bottom right. Now it's going to ask you some simple questions. Does your keyboard have RGB lighting uh, or backlight? Personally, for all my keyboards, they all have backlight or RGB lighting. So I will click yes, it does. And then it's going to ask you what connector your keyboard is using. Most keyboards these days are using USB-C. Double check just in case if you have mini USB or micro USB on your keyboard. And then lastly, it's going to ask you what connector you're going to be using uh, for your computer and I personally go with USB-A but there is also the USB-C option and then you're going to hit continue to the next step and then we're brought over to the coils which is really really cool uh, it's going to ask you what direction you like so look in your keyboard see where the connector is coming from if it's, the connector is coming from the left side of the keyboard you want it to go to the right if the connector is going from the right side of the keyboard you want to go to the left uh, most of my keyboards come out of the left, so I'm going to go ahead and click right. And it's going to ask you if you want your cable to go straight out or upwards. I personally go with straight out just because it looks cooler on the desk, but I do have cables that also go upwards as well. So we're going to click that and continue on the next step. And now this is all the fun stuff. So I'm going to tell you guys right now, personally with my build, I did not change any of the default uh, measurements. So a lot of the stuff here is already set to, you know, 150 millimeters, 13 millimeters, 50 millimeters, and 1200 millimeters. So all these stuffs are already basically calculated for you by cable mod and you don't really have to think about how long your cable needs to be but let's say you have a bigger desk or a, a larger area or even a smaller area you can customize that to your liking but personally i will stick to default so i'm going to continue to the next step here and now we're at the fun page and this is where we're going to be able to customize a lot of the colors which is going to be really fun so the first thing i'm going to do is going to work with the keyboard connector color uh, and I'm going to try to do something nice and like sleek. And usually I either go with anodized silver, anodized gold. Uh, for this time, I'm going to do anodized gold and I'm going to save that. And then we're going to go ahead and change the sleeving colors up here. And this is going to ask you uh, what colors you want to go mix and match between the double coiled sleeves. So I went ahead and experimented a little bit and I actually went with the black cover on top and also the base color of red, which is really cool. And we're going to save that and it shows you on the website how it would look so far. There is something that's mismatching and that is the connector. So we're going to go ahead and change this real quick and just going to click that QDC button. And now you're able to change it from an aviator cable to a slimline cable, which is really cool. Personally, I went with this when I built my red cable. And so I'm going to click that real quick and it's going to give you some better options in my opinion, because the aviator cable, you don't have the gold coating, which is what I want to go for uh, with this red and gold colorway. So we're going to go ahead and click this gold anodized uh, slimline connector on the front and also on the back. And we're going to Ahead and save that real quick so there we go and look at that we have a properly built cable from cable mod all done super super easy and now we just got to go ahead and continue to the next step and it's where you get all your specs for your cable which is really really cool and just double checking everything just in case you mess something up and once you double check and everything's correct you hit yep that's correct and then it's going to automatically send you to your cart and then this is what the price came up to be a hundred dollars and ninety cents for a keyboard cable you can configure this to a much cheaper option i went with the slimline option that did add sixteen dollars uh, but there's other options again to build your custom cable uh, the only thing i will say is that the shipping is kind of expensive at twenty dollars unfortunately i wish it would be free shipping from cable mod but but hey, it is what it is. But yeah, that's how I ended up with my keyboard cable. It was so, so easy to build with Cable Mod. Honestly, uh, this website just makes it so much easier with their interface. I know there's some other keyboard cable makers out there that makes it a little bit more complicated to build your custom cables. Uh, so Cable Mod making it so much easier for you is uh, a really nice touch to this whole custom keyboard world. So yeah, thank you Cable Mod for allowing me to do this and also building 
my custom cables with you guys. And again, Cable Mod has amazing options already straight out of their website that you can just buy on your own and even on Amazon if you guys want to order from them as well. Thank you, Cable Mod, for this amazing opportunity. I really, really appreciate this. If you guys did like this video, hit that like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys later. Peace!